fish tank today. I walked out. Me and Connor Riley. I'll tell the story once a couple more joys about what this place really means. I'm serious and wait till other people join to tell what the real fish tank really is. What they really do to people in that fucking house. I'm having a lot of people join. Sorry. I need you all to hear. I, I, they're all saying go back. Jacqueline, Alex, X. They're all, they're all, they're all, y'all, let me tell you about the fish tank. Yeah. They're all, let me tell you about, hey guys, I left today. I'm five minutes down the street, but I'm telling you, I would have beat that rapist to death. He threatened to make my family sell the one. I'm 36, buddy. Want to see my ID? It's right over here. I don't give a fuck. Where's my fucking passport, baby? I'll cover the ID. Where's my passport? Passport somewhere around here. Anyways, anyways, King Kong, that house, motherfucker. And let me tell you something. You thought my monkeys was fake? Well, you go to my page. Oh, wait, y'all already know. They play jokes on us. You know what I left? They brought a rapist in that. Oh, they're begging me. You, I'm going to post. I'm going to post the. They're begging me to come back to the house. Begging me. I will show you. I will show you their screenshots. Will from production. They're begging me to come back. They're begging me. Thank you, guys. I appreciate all your fucking support. But look, they're begging me. I love everybody out there saying this. I'm getting constant, constant comments. Hey, my daughter's in here. All right. Alex, it's going over. crazy on here. See, guys, G is a liar. His name is Samuel Hyde. He's a rapist, a known pedophile. This is not a joke, guys. That guy, you saw the thing last night. You saw that fight go down today. And all that fight with me telling everybody that I was explaining what happened. Sorry, I can't see all your comments right now. I'll try to get back to them as soon as I can. But let me explain, please. So check me out. Okay, so this is what happened. That big guy locked me in the room and they edited the scene. When my wife and daughter, they had their phones recording the whole time. When my wife and daughter said they were getting them cash and prizes, G told them to get the fuck out and threw their purses at him, you goddamn pieces of shit. Didn't give anything. Not one person has been paid since they left the show. Not one person has been paid anything. Not one person has paid a thing. Guys, they held me against the will in my room. They just don't know that Jacqueline recorded it the whole time and they posted it. That guy held me against the will. And remember I was freaking out that no one believed me? Why do you think me and Connor, he was doing the same shit to people today? G cut it from the edit. G literally cut it from the fucking edit, but my wife, she recorded the whole shit. The whole thing, he blocked me when I put my goddamn elbow in his fucking neck. I said, this is how it's going to go down. I grabbed the light load in the fucking confession room. And there's Vin knocking on the door. Come out. Because they don't let us fucking touch. He goes that. I broke his glasses twice. I took that fat fucking glasses off his fucking big teddy fucking man shit twice. I fucking eat him. I'm the fucking monkey cobra king. You want, you want me to post the text where they're begging like babies to come out? Do you follow me in my driveway? Please don't go, Alex. Please don't go. You brought the highest ratings, dude. Please think about this. He chased me outside. I won't disqualify you just because you went outside. Uh, uh, uh. You want me to show you the text? Production sending me to come back. They won't even, I bet they stop now, but they've asked me to come back at least six, seven times since the past two hours. They might stop now because I call motherfuckers out like the umpire. They said they were going to pay me five grand. They ain't gonna, I ain't going to get shit. I doubt it because they actually follow through with nothing. Not one contestant has been fucking paid. That is the real truth. I haven't been able to shift your questions. So guys, let me vent. Please let me vent for a moment. I love you guys for listening to me. And thank, I'm going to go through your comments. You just got to understand, I thought I was making my family fucking proud. I thought I was doing something good by my mama, by my family. I appreciate it. I, I didn't even know if it was them just downstairs giving me fake support. I don't know if it was real. Those guys fucked me up on the inside. That I can't touch them. I grabbed a fork. I was about to stab that motherfucking fat motherfucker in the neck. Those homeless fucks. And nobody believed what I was saying. I wish I could read what I was saying. Uh, Frank was right. I heard there's a lot of wild randies. I'd beat that motherfucker to death, bruh. To death. I don't use those motherfuckers, dude. Were y'all watching that fight run around? Look at my pretty face. Look at Symbol. He's got a big fat busted lip. I was raining on him. He didn't land one punch. I'm a smoker. I never not. I got no stamina. That's why I finish fights in fucking 40, 30 seconds. Shit. Anyways, fucking, uh, the point is, oh, they played it back and they said I won. Don't worry. They gave me a big, a big prize. They gave me $1,000 for winning the fight because they... They did. They fucking rolled them back and gave me a thousand fuck fish bucks. It's even real fucking money. But anyways, um, 
Yeah, everybody, I quit her because fucking a, a rapist. What if they said they're going to rape your family, your niece, your nephew, your, uh, your daughter, your sister, your husband, whatever. You, that shit. I put my neck, but they're going to kick you off the show if you hurt him. I bathe him. I spit on him. Y'all saw me. He blew smoke in my face. I loogied in his goddamn face six times. That's more of a reason to hit me first. I loogied on him. He didn't dare spit on me. I broke his glasses, guys. I broke his glasses twice. Broke his glasses.